Okay now, so we will be talking now about mode, no? Mode. Okay, mode. So this is give uh, this is uh, symbolized by x with a some kind of a um, half big triangle uh, above. So the mode is just the most uh, it's just uh, the data that has the most number of repetitions okay so this is a very easy uh, way to measure the central tendency of a uh, group of data okay so if we if you go to the ungrouped data okay, group data for example we have 7, 8, 9, 12, 12, 14, 16, 16, 19, 22, 22, and 25. So we just find what data or, would, or what are the data that is most repeated. Okay, so for this given, we have 11, we have 16, and we have 22. So our mode is 11 16 and 22 and we could call call this group of data as tri modal so a group of data can have as much as many um many mode so it could be a bimodal trimodal polymodal multimodal depending on what data are ha, are are re, repeated or what data or data that is repeated the highest for example if there are three data that is repeated they are tied they are re repeated in the same number then those three data are the mode for that group of data okay so that that is applicable in group or ungroup data now in ungroup data so we'll go to our um, table which we did last time okay so the same tables we have the same data so in order for us to get the mode so we just look at the look at the column for frequency the class that has the highest number of frequency as this one this is eight so that class is our mode class. So our mode class is mode class is 67.5 to 74.5. So that is our mode class. Now our mode in this one is not the class. Our mode is the midpoint of that mode class, this one. So our mode is 71. For example, during the getting the frequency distribution table so for example this one became uh, seven this is seven so we have now one two three four four classes that has seven frequencies so we will get each of their midpoint so this one is seven so our mode is 92 then this one so seven so 71 then 64 then 57 so we have four modes in a given group of data but for this one let's just undo everything so our mode in this data is just 71 so that is how easy in getting the mode of a certain data okay so thank you for watching this video and as always keep on studying